In this video, we're gonna take a look at aspect ratio and resolution. This usually relates to videos being recorded in the wrong resolution and wrong aspect ratio. When we talk about resolution, we're talking about pixel density or the number of pixels per image in our video. Essentially, the more pixels there are, the more clarity there is in our video. We tend to measure resolution by the number of pixels horizontally and the number of pixels vertically. You've probably heard of the terms 720p or 1080p or even 4K. These phrases refer to how many pixels there are in our video vertically. Aspect ratio defines how many pixels there are horizontally and how many there are vertically and then breaks this down into a fraction commonly either 16 by 9 or 4 by 3. Dividing this down gives us our total aspect ratio. I personally recommend using a 16 by 9 ratio, which is supported by most video players, and a resolution of 1080p. Using this ratio tells us that we would need 1920 pixels on the horizontal line and 1080 pixels on the vertical line, commonly referred to as 1920 by 1080p. There are two areas of your video production process where you need to take this into account and that's the size of the screen that you are recording or the portion of the screen you are recording and the canvas size in your editing suite. It's best practice to keep these two values the same as it makes it a lot easier to export and work with your project. In summary, if you want a high quality image that fills your screen correctly, then it's best to use a 16 by nine ratio at 1080p. Let's go and take a look at our first demo where I will show you how you can set the aspect ratio or resolution in Camtasia Recorder. So over in Windows, let's go ahead and open Camtasia Recorder. On the left, you can see the recording area. And you'll see here that we have dimensions. The resolution of my monitor is a 1920 by 1080p display, which is full HD, and it has auto detected that ready for recording. There are other options. Next to the screen on or screen off button, we have a drop down arrow. By clicking this, we can see a list of other options from 1080p, 720p, 480, and that's all, all at the 16 by nine ratio, which is the standard widescreen ratio. Older monitors will use a four by three ratio, which in my opinion, isn't ideal for making videos. So as said before, let's stick to 1920 by 1080p or higher if you're using say OBS or another screen recording software that allows you to do so. If you wanted to record a different aspect ratio or different portion of your screen to put into your 16 by nine main video, say for example, you had a presentation where you wanted to place a video inside the presentation, you can adjust your settings here. You can also click the drop down arrow and you can lock to application or select an area to record. Selecting an area to record allows you to select and drag a portion of your screen uh, in which you want to record. You can also grab these little squares in the corners of your screen to fine tune and adjust the section of video that you want to record. But remember to always record at least 16 by 9 1080p ratio for your main video. This is predominantly only for adding extra tiny snippets of video to your main video. So I hope this little tip has made sense to you and you was able to follow along with everything I've just demonstrated and I'll be seeing you in another video.